Hey guys, it's Emily Davenport and guess what came in the mail today? Finally, the fall and winter testers are here. So I have the new releases and I am so excited. There's 10 new release scents and I'm gonna share them with you guys. I have not sniffed these yet because I wanted to do like a first sniffs, like first impressions video. So that's what we're gonna do right now. So I'm just gonna go in order that they're in the catalog. So the first one is Almond Croissant. I have them in front of me. So if you see me reaching. This one says fresh baked croissant, cinnamon, sugar, and almond are the notes in this one. And it's nice, this is a nice bakery scent. This would be a good mixer too. I feel like if you like sugar cookie or vanilla bean buttercream, you would like this because I don't really smell a lot of almond and it's like a, it's a lighter cinnamon. It's not like a super heavy cinnamon, so. That one's nice. I really like this one. I think I'm gonna get that in the full bar. The next one is um, Apple and Oats. Ooh, this says rich buttery oats, caramelized apple, and hints of cinnamon. I actually don't smell any cinnamon in this. Kind of reminds me of like a apple um, oatmeal, like a really like light apple oatmeal. This one is nice too, if you like apple, but you don't really want, um, if you like apple bakery, but you don't really want a lot of cinnamon, that one is nice. Okay, around the campfire, I'm nervous about this one because I don't really like woodsy scents and this one's in the woods category. So if you like Bonfire Beach, this is probably the one. Oh yeah. It says mountain air, fresh fallen wood and smoky embers. Yeah, you know what? I smell all of those things. You get kind of like this fresh scent with the woods and then like the embers like kind of on the end. I don't mind it, but if you like woodsy scents, I would give this one a try around the campfire. It is, Bonfire Beach is sweeter than this, I would say. And I think Bonfire Beach smells more like, uh, like definitely campfire on the beach. Whereas this one is kind of like campfire in the fall. <laughs> that makes sense. <laughs> but if you like woodsy scents, you will like that one. Autumn Road Trip is the next one. This one says, take a tour through crisp harvest apple, just pick Anjou pear and silver oak. This smells similar to something. Hmm. This smells like something that I know. Okay, so I get a little bit of apple. I smell pear, but I definitely smell like the oak in the background. Kind of reminds me of the craft store a little bit. I don't know, it's nice. Kind of like potpourri, but I definitely smell the silver oak. I'd be interested to see how this smells in bar form. It says it's fruity. I definitely smell the pear and the apple. This one's interesting. I'm gonna have to think about what this reminds me of. There's something that I've like used before, like maybe something in my mom's house that this reminds me of. But it's nice though, it is nice. Okay, the next one is Best in Snow. This is in the fresh category. Ooh, it says Frosted Evergreen Cool Mint and Icy Air. This smells like, um, you definitely smell the mint, like cool mint, if you like minty scents. This smells like cool mint gum, like that icy, isn't there like some kind of like, uh, mints that you put in your mouth and it's like cold what are they called it's kind of like that i actually like this though i don't smell a lot of the evergreen i smell a lot of the mint and the icy air so like it doesn't really smell like a christmas tree it smells like mint cool mint and this is nice and re this is really nice and refreshing especially if you like fresh scents 
oh this is really nice i like this if you need to like clean out your like if your house like you just need like a refreshing scent best in snow i would go with this and honestly you could you could do this all year round it doesn't like to me it doesn't smell like a christmasy scent based on the tester like, that one i actually really like that one okay the next one is breakfast and bed and actually i have a full bar of this one because my bar came before my testers came oh this one is really nice it says pumpkin pastry filled with black raspberry topped with a sweet cinnamon drizzle this is the bar Oop, the sun is like coming in oh my god this is amazing this is in the bakery category, and if you like bakery scents, this is, oh. You guys, this is making me so hungry. I smell pumpkin pastry. I smell a little bit of raspberry, like the raspberry that's in black raspberry vanilla, because it is black raspberry, with a little bit of cinnamon. Oh my God, this is like a, like a delicious cinnamon roll, like a fall cinnamon roll. If you like bakery, pumpkin, raspberry, cinnamon, you need to get this. You need to get this. This is so good. This is one of my top fall scents. And you guys know that I'm not really a fall scents kind of girl. I really, really like that. I might have to keep that all year round in my club. <laughs> the next one is Cloudberry Dreams. And it says sweet raspberry, a whisper of rose, um, peach, and vanilla. This is in the fruity category. No, you. <laughs> okay, I smell raspberry, but I really do smell rose. I don't really get peach and vanilla, but I definitely smell rose. So if you like raspberry and you like rose, I think you'll like this. Um, I think the rose is gonna come through a little bit too much for me. And I did see some other consultants say that also. Um, and I don't really like, I'm not really a rose girl but if you like raspberry and rose I think you'll really like this I do smell a little bit of peach and vanilla but not really I think it's kind of all blending together so that one's cloudberry dreams I was actually excited about that one but then I heard people saying the rose was like not just a whisper like it says in here so um but if you like raspberry and you like rose scents I think you'll really like that one the next one is dancing sugar plums dancing sugar plums which you guys know I had to get because obviously dancing um dancing sugar plums hello and I actually have a bar of this one too but I'm trying to see if the tests are smells the same but oh this one is good too if you like plum so this says rich spiced plum vanilla and cinnamon apple are the notes in this one um yes this is a nice plum scent it definitely is spiced plum so I'm trying to think of what this reminds me of because like some kind of candy and I can't put my finger on what it is like a, some kind of like cinnamon candy but it's like plum it's like a maybe like a one of the gumdrops like my mom like we had this gum gumdrop tree and like I feel like this reminds me of one of the gumdrop flavors this one is actually in the woods category which is interesting because I definitely smell the plum I don't really smell apple. This is nice. This is woodsy, but it's not too woodsy, if that makes sense. Like, around the campfire is very woods. Oh, I'm sorry. This is not woodsy, you guys. This is spice. Hello. <laughs> I'm sorry. Spice. Spiced plum, vanilla, cinnamon, apple. I was like, this is woods? What? Um, yeah, this is a nice one. If you like plum and you like, it's not too strong of cinnamon. I feel like it blends really nicely together. So I actually really like that one too. I'm excited to see how these will warm. I'm not quite there yet though. I don't start till September. I don't warm my fall scents till September. The next one is just for you. This is in the woods category. Wild blackberry, fir balsam, and pine needles. Oh. This is a sweet Christmassy scent. So we have like very snowy spruce and Christmas cactus. This is like lighter than all of the fur, the fur, all of the tree scents that we have. Um, 
And the blackberry really like does sweeten it up like it says. I smell the pine needles. I smell the, I think fir balsam, whatever that is. I smell the pine needles, but the wild blackberry really sweetens it so it's not too like tree, like tree -y. Is that, that's not a word, I made it up. It smells really, this is actually really nice. So if you want like a Christmas tree scent, kind of like subtle in the background, if you have like an artificial tree but you kind of want something but you don't want it to be so overpowering this is actually really nice and it's light it is going to be light just for you and it's cute because it's spelled just fur like f-i-r cute okay and the last one is slay all day it's a snow kissed mint juniper and mountain air are the notes this is also a fresh scent it's soapy this one is soapy to me. Whereas like Best in Snow, this one is definitely like cool, minty, like a like a icy mint. This says Snow Kissed Mint. I don't know what Juniper is. Um, and then Mountain Air. This is like, to me, this is like a sweeter mint scent, if that makes sense. But it also, to some people, I feel like it could smell like soap not bad though it's definitely sweet and it's like probably medium I would say but I haven't warmed any of these yet so so that's it that's all 10 of the new release scents um I really like I think almond croissant I really like breakfast in bed is definitely my favorite and then Best in Snow, like that one actually kind of surprised me because I'm not really like a fresh scent person, but I would definitely put that like in the bathroom to just like make it like freshen it, things up. So um, yeah, if you guys liked this video, let me know. Um, let me know which scents you're excited to try because I do have the testers here. So um, I will be making some samples and I also have some scented stickers for my customers that I will be sending out shortly. So um, thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know which scent you guys are most excited to try and I will talk to you guys later. Bye.